Welcome back to the Rink Sharks. It's Coach Greg, and we've got a new drill for you guys today. I'm struggling to come up with a nifty, simple name for this drill, so we'll call this the drill with no name. Helping us with the drill with no name, we have Henry Smith, we have Ben, we have Matia, and we have Jabril. Henry Smith is player number one, and uh, Ben is player number two, Matia, player number three, and Jabril, player number four. And this fine gentleman right here is Coach Hugo. Let's watch the drill. You'll see there's two versions of it. See if you can notice what the difference is. Did you notice the difference yet? I'm sure you did. So one of them is a dump and chase with a four check, and the other one we're passing and carrying the puck into the offensive zone to create an opportunity. Let's just break down the drill so we all feel really comfortable about what each player's role is in the drill. Let's start with Jabril. Jabril, he's going to pass the puck to player number one, Henry. When Henry curls around this pylon here, the third pylon. So that's Jabril's job. So then we know, of course, that Henry's job is to skate around these pylon, curl here with his stick on the ice, and receive a pass from Jabril. Now while that's happening, Ben will also be curling around this first pylon and again following the same path as Henry to the second pylon, but as opposed to going to the third pylon, Ben will curl and cut up the ice, angling slightly towards the boards. Mattia will be skating hard behind the net, curling around this first pylon and almost immediately start cutting into the train tracks. All right, so let's watch that. They all leave at the same time. Okay, so now you see Matya, he's heading into the train tracks. Henry Smith has the puck. And Ben is skating up the ice, sort of towards the boards. Henry Smith carries the puck a small bit makes a bank pass on his side of the blue line. And you can see already that Ben is ready to get that bank pass. He anticipates what's happening, all right? There could even be some communication here from Henry and Ben. Right here, Ben might be hollering to Henry, boards, boards, telling Henry to bank it off the boards and Ben will pick it up. Mattia is hauling butt in the train tracks. And as soon as he sees this puck dumped in the end by Ben, he knows what his job is. Mattia knows he is the first one into the offensive zone and that makes him F1 and his job is to hustle his bustle down to that puck. And he does a great job of blocking off Coach Hugo and forcing Coach Hugo to take one path to the puck. And that path, we can see Ben coming in to support. Now, Matthew does such a great job against his dad that he wins the battle for the puck. Ben notices this and starts moving to a more offensive area. And while all that hard forecheck is happening by our F1, Matia, and our F2, Ben, Henry Smith has been going hard he makes this initial pass and then he has to hustle to stay relevant in the play, to stay important to the play. Hits the train tracks, gets to the slot with a stick on the ice and buries it for a goal. So that is an excellent, excellent dump and chase four check that turns into a goal. So let's watch the second version of the drill. 
and let's see the difference. So again, it begins the same. All the players leave at the same time. Their paths are the same. Henry Smith receives this pass. Matthew is in the train tracks. Ben is skating up ice, angling slightly towards the boards. The bank pass is made. Ben picks it up. But here, he passes the puck over to Matthew. So at this point, Matthew's job is to get the puck across the blue line as efficiently as possible. Efficiently means in a timely fashion. So we don't want to waste time with lots of fancy stick handling and, and uh, little dangles at the blue line. We want him to accelerate and blow past this blue line and skate for open ice. So that's why he goes a bit wide. He's finding open ice and that's also helping him create a better angle to make a pass to Ben who is doing a great job skating right at the post. He's skating towards this far, this post right here. Okay. He opens up and receives a great pass. And while all that's happening, of course, Henry Smith works hard to get back in the play and takes his spot as F3 as the trailer. So he's an option here. He could get a pass. He could get a pass here again, and he's primed here ready for a rebound as well. So he's done a great job. So there you go. That's the other version of this drill. So this is the drill with no name. Let's watch it one more time. I must admit, Matthew does get the better of his dad in this drill, doesn't he? So that's one for Mattia, zero for Coach Hugo. And let's see the second second version. And you'll see it ends up two for Mattia, zero for Coach Hugo. <laughs> so now look at this pass that Mattia makes right by his dad. Zing. Now, those things can only happen, guys, if we have our heads up, if we have our sticks on the ice, and we're working together, right? It's going to be a lot of fun to do this drill. I know that you guys are doing going to do it really, really well. So, I look forward to seeing you guys at the rink soon. And, uh, yeah, that's that. Bye.